This review is of Andy Boy Fennel, or Anis, or Anis, however you want to say it. This is, uh, sorry, it looks a bit bedraggled. I just washed it, so it's a bit heavy with uh, water up here in the leaves. But as you can see, the leaves are very, very thin. It's very, sim very similar in appearance to the kind of leaves you see on dill, although dill is not exactly the same as this. And the flavor is a bit different as well. Now, the other a couple of days ago, I made a vegan sandwich, and I put some of this on there. I wasn't sure what it was going to taste like. I used some um, uh, different condiments, but I could taste the fennel uh, leaves, and it was very, very enjoyable, except for when I hit one of these larger pieces of stem. I had one in there, and that kind of um, interfered a little bit in terms of not uh, flavor-wise, but just chewing it. I had to, you know, bite through the fiber of it. But uh, ultimately, I really thought that that was a nice addition. And it has this nice flavor that's kind of similar to, um, to um, licorice, but unlike the strong flavor that some people find offensive about licorice, this does not have that flavor. Um, it's a sweet flavor um, and fairly mild tasting, but very pleasant, and I think it adds uh, a nice nuance to um, other things. Now, I'm not an expert in cooking this stuff, but I'm going to try and learn about it um, because I really think this is something really quite nice. Oh yeah, nice. So um, this is um, may, uh, grown in the U.S. It's number four five one five from Andy Boy. Thank you very much for watching. Oh, I'm gonna give this a nine. I hope you have a great day.